Hi there, uh, my name is Campbell Barbie. I'm the uh, Daily Free uh, Meals Program Manager. So what I do here at Glide is uh, manage the, the, the daily meals program, which consists of breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, we start early in the morning, um, around 6.30, uh, through lunch, is a normal time at 12, and uh, dinner at 5. Um, I also um, help with the zero waste food pantry, um, work on grants, uh, contracts, and um, with many of the other programs uh, that we have here at Glide. I think what attracted me the most about working at Glide was uh, a feeling of serving my community. And certainly Glide is all about the community. Um, I've had other jobs where it's been part of my um, daily routine or you know long-term kind of strategic plan, but uh, it's, a, it's, it's the first place I've ever worked at where the community members are at the center of, of the work we do. Right now I'm working on, I'm in year three of a, a transformative social change uh, PhD program uh, and this summer and fall I'm actually working on uh, literature reviews um, and uh, to qualify for the dissertation process. So this summer I'll be looking at um, what is food insecurity, uh, how uh, government systems fail or succeed, um, and in the fall I'll be looking at uh, community-led or supported food systems. And I hope to finish my PhD work um, by 2025 and come out with a better understanding of how I can insert myself and serve uh, the community better and address hunger. One of the things I was most excited about last year was the USDA, USDA visit at Glide. We spoke to Dr. Bleich about a number of issues that uh, are affecting our own communities here in San Francisco, particularly on food insecurity. Uh, the message that we were unified on was uh, making access to food a human right, and that choice has to be part of, part of that access policy. I think the thing that keeps me mo most motivated here at Glide is the possibility of change. Not only do you see the lines going down the street, uh, but we, we experience it inside as well. So ending that cycle of poverty for folks by helping them with either job skills and job placement, uh, finding a place to live, childcare, any of those opportunities to, to end the cycle of poverty uh, really excites me and gives me hope.